Carjackings are on the rise and have become a consistent problem across the nation and here in the city of Laurel. In 2021, nearly 200 cars were stolen. Laurel surpassed that number in 2022. Some Pacific areas are being targeted, as Officer Pat Henson explains. Well, for starters, uh, carjacking is on the rise within the city as well as throughout the nation, and definitely within the region. The region has gone up uh, considerably. They could happen almost anywhere. Usually it's in a place that's more secluded. Uh, it happens at intersections when people are unaware. They're listening to music around their cell phone. They stop, they have their windows door down or either their doors unlocked. While the places we frequent daily are hot spots, officers warn that you should always pay attention to your surroundings at all times. Predators are sitting and watching for people that are unaware of their surroundings. So no matter what age you are, if you seem like you're just really not paying attention or very unattentive, then it makes you more of a person that they probably be likely to actually confront. The Lowell Police Department is working diligently to cut down on the number of carjackings in our community. But there are things we can do to protect ourselves. I wouldn't go to an ATM that is in a secluded area um, because then you, you put yourself at a potential higher risk. If I was going to use an ATM, I would probably go during the daytime or definitely someplace that is lots of people and it's, it's public. One of the common ways car theft can happen is by not locking your door. Uh, often people are going to the mall or shopping. Uh, if you're going somewhere, a really big one is that you plan parking. Uh, so you should try to park your vehicle somewhere where it's well lit. Another tactic for a criminal is to hit your car, then try to steal it while you're assessing the damage. However, police advise that you wait for an officer and not confront criminals. You realize that it's probably people's natural reaction to feel like, hey, this is my car, I worked hard to try to buy it, obtain it, and uh, you're probably your first reaction would be, you know what, to, to fight back or resist. But again, um, the car can be replaced. Your life is far more valuable than uh, the price of the vehicle. For Laurel TV, I'm Jamal Williams.